Hello people, welcome! Episode 25 of my Season 3 Let's Play! How are you doing? I am here and you can see I I am modification, modificating a little my forestry, uh, well, wood plantation. And that's because I plan to make it uh, self-sustaining. So for, uh, for that I am going to place here temporarily this is connected to a hundred one, so I can ask for items. Uh, in fact, I am going to ask right now. Well, first I'm going to ask for a crafting table because I don't really like to take uh, take out the the philosopher stone from my from my little bag in here. And uh, the next thing I want to ask here is for some lapis. I am going to ask for two pieces of lapis lazuli. So let's place here the, if I can manage, yeah, the chest. And I am going to craft. You already saw me do, do, to do this in the last episode. Yeah, supplier logistics pipes. I am going to place it uh, in here. And I am going to graft one of these humus and my wrench because I want it to keep uh, three stacks of um, of humus in the arboretum. Well, make it two. Only two is enough. Now I need to connect this to the system. Of course, we have a small problem. And I might need to ask if I am remember right for a gold uh, or one of these diamonds pipe. This is a vanilla build craft item that will help us discriminate a different kind of stuff. So uh, from here, items will get out. Uh, let me. Okay, I can cover this and this, and I can cover this and this now. Perfect. Uh, from here, items will come out, which will be the wood. From upside, uh, we will see both uh, the leaves and the apples. Sorry, the leaves, the saplings and the apples. The saplings will remain here, thanks for to this insertion pipe. And uh, there's nothing else to do, really. So, uh, just to connect it all to single system. However, uh, we need a diamond transport pipe to tell the system where can items go. So let's place it in here, this in here, and this in here. Finally, we're going to place here the teleporting pipe, which is going to be connected to frequency 1. Hmm. This is a small problem because frequency 1 is essentially the sorting system. However, remember we are using a logistic pipe sorting system. So it should be good, especially since we are talking about wood here, if I hooked it directly to frequency well I'm going to use frequency a hundred because I am I don't feel comfortable with the system working with so many frequencies or more specifically to have so many connections to the same uh, to the same numbers so let's place it in oh dear not uh, that good an idea I didn't remember they uh, connect together. Anyway, frequency is a hundred, and they can receive. I think in in 1.1, which was uh, the last version of Minecraft I did play, they would never connect together. I don't know; it's a little shocking right now. Anyway, it is connected and can receive through because it needs to communicate with there. And you can see it is not going to work, or I think it won't work unless I place here uh, one of these pipes. 
Now I need to graph here a piece of humus and I am going to need both uh, here and here. Let's hope the system doesn't really take... Uh, well, won't be mad with me because I took that. Okay. Now, uh, to blue it's going to go this and this and this and uh, wood. Perfect. This is everything we can produce in this in this system. And to black, humus is going to go. Perfect. Now if I take a full stack of humus, we should be seeing we should be seeing can receive true frequency a hundred. Yeah, we are seeing humus coming down. Perfect. So now essentially this system is completely automatic. I can completely forgot about this uh, about this, which now uh, takes us to my next project. You might have noticed I am not really taking much work uh, when it comes to this uh, rest, uh, industrial craft rubber trees. Uh, that's because, fr frank frankly, I am at a point of the game. See what I told you? See? There are two now. Oh dear, this is impressive. I swear I did nothing here. This is uh, quite an, uh, a funny bug I have in here. Oh well. Ah, uh, might be the right from this. And of course I should make some sort of extraction pipe to take items to the system. So let me place uh, this in here and this in here and connect this to frequency 101 can receive true. And let's see, uh, an extraction pipe... No, we need an extraction module. And a logistics, at least Mark 1 chassis. Okay, can do that. Uh, let's ask for 8 redstone, which is uh, what we need for a Mark 1. Yes, I know I got sidetracked. However, what can I do? And uh, a Mark II requires, let me think for a second, uh, Mark one and... Uh, there we go. Provider module requires a gold gear. No, extractor module. Okay, I'm going to need the gold gear, an iron gear, four lapis. Perfect. So storage, I require a blank uh, card. You need to have a blank card somewhere. Come on, tell me where are you, where is it? Can't believe I. Oh well. Uh, let me find it and ask for it, and I'll go back to you. Okay, I asked for it, and I got what I asked for. Perfect. And here we go. Structure module mark one. Structure module mark two. A logistic pass chassis pipe. <coughs> and the mess I made. So we essentially place here the logistic pipe. Oh dear. Can't really extract from two uh, at the same time, can we? Going to need to ask for another. Oh well. Very well, data again, so let's go placing. Mm, okay, shift click won't work here, but I believe we can make a small arrangement. Yeah, perfect. Now, if I take this item teleporting pipe and hook it to frequency 1, can receive false. I can now go in here and say, hey, we go. 
course, a much more cheaper version would be to... Now, is, is it working? I don't believe it is. Nope, it's not. Oh dear. So all this, all that crafting for nothing. Oh well, Ca what can I say? Ah yes, yes, I know what can I say. Damn, so to say. Ah, uh, let's try something else entirely. Send me two redstone engines, please. Uh, let's storage this and this and this and this. Let me grab myself two wooden pipes and one iron pipe. I'm going to need this too. Okay, got the rest on engines. Perfect. Perfect land. And let's place this again. I might need to use the site after all. Mm. Oh, didn't want to do that. Yes, I am such clots. I know. Okay, this goes in here. And now we get uh, the item teleporting pipe. Frequency 1. Let me take out these boots because they are being a nuisance as usual. Let me place this in here. Okay. And out. Perfect. Fall into the ground is uh, unadvisable. Ah, it's jumping, what makes things go awry. Okay, and now I need the boots, of course. Let me whack this so uh, perfect. And yeah, I can't really place anything there. Let's grab, uh, for example, two levers and see if now this works. If not, I will have to surrender and use the side. Okay, now it works. Now this system will work uh, automatically, automatically too, which is good. I don't understand the reason behind this uh, spawning of uh, of cards, but well, they can stay there for now. If uh, well, as I told you before, once I had a surplus, I deleted it, and I found myself with the problem of not having any, so I had to go back and etc. 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 Anyway. We are going to craft another Arboretum, because it's part of what we are going to do next. Uh, let me see. You can go in there too. And you. So, for the Arboretum we require... We require... Here it is. Uh, bronze. We are going to use bronze, I believe. We're going to need to craft ourselves some sturdy machines, which are crafted like this. Yes, we're going to need at least uh, three, if I am not mistaken. And the Arboretum is crafted with a sturdy machine, glass and gold. Now the logger requires diamonds, oh dear. And what I am going to craft, you might remember it for previous Let's Play, or might, well, it's easy to, dedu to deduce since I already told you. <coughs> mm, I was quite tired for to use the um, manually. Oh, great! To use manually. Uh, well, anyway, I am going to craft this three tap. Perfect. 
uh, squeezer or no no centrifuge no thank you no thank you where the hell is it carpenter maybe it has been changed let me check the wiki for seconds okay I don't know if it's uh, going to work or not but oh well one two oh too many well no, don't not to worry uh, not like I really care about this so I am going to craft first the tree tap which will gather automatically all uh, industrial craft rubber trees wood uh, well whatever uh, sticky resin and now I am going to craft an arboretum and hope it will work with um, with industrial craft. In the previous version, the arboretum would uh, let me place, yeah, for example, in here, and uh, this in here, and this in here. Perfect. This goes in there. So in previous version, the arboretum would uh, simply not work with industrial craft uh, saplings. It would require a particular version. However, seems like now it won't have the, uh, such a problem. Let me try to alter the odds on our favor. Hey, perfect. Don't you love when things work the way they should? Essentially, I am going to make sure I won't be losing any uh, possibility of creating rubber trees later. Oops, night time. <laughs> Didn't even notice it. So let's go and check. And there's a slime out there, I can hear it. Where are you? Oh, it was a zombie. Why aren't you burning? Oh well. Ah, you are. You are perfect. Perfect. Okay. Uh, so the area is the same. So let me think for a second. One, two. Uh, yes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. So if these are the two outer, uh, one, two, three, four, and it should be in here. Like, uh, but let's place it a little farther away, just in case. Okay, let's place this in here, and we only like this one which we can place for example in here perfect okay uh, let's grab some humus which uh, this has more than enough and remember the system will try to replace the humus immediately let's place it in here and let's see can I place hopefully this won't uh, have some trouble and of course I need to craft myself some power system so I'll be back as soon as I finish doing that okay let's do this uh, golden pipe to here here and here now the wooden conductive pipe uh, we can place it in here for example the engines um, here and here, for example, uh, the isolated cabling there, <clears throat> and the low voltage in here. Now we only need to power the items to go. Perfect. You there, and well, you can only be in here. Uh, let's graph the um, levers to rigueur and uh, here and here okay 
Okay, both engines are working. And for now, let's remove these two. So only the Arboretum gets... Uh, And I believe not, the saplings are not going to, or maybe yes, I don't know. We shall see. In the meantime, yeah, they are working, perfect. So, seems like the new version of forestry won't need a particular version of uh, the Arboretum for each uh, different kind of trees, which is nice to, to know. So, uh, essentially this is going to work the same way this is, uh, and of course I should play some sort of uh, auto-feeding system. So let's graph our basic logistic pipes, our remote orderer, and uh, I might need this anyway. And let's graph, where's my teleporting pipes in here? Perfect. So. Place you there, place you here. Oh, not talking about you and your protagonist complex. Okay, and now we shall ask for two pieces of uh, lapis. And I am going to ask for eight of these because ODR. And by the way, I'm going to need one of these. <coughs> Mm -hmm. Perfect. <clears throat> so again, a supplier pipe that goes on the bottom. And we need to tell it to keep a... St uh, don't, where is my wrench? I forgot my wrench. Where? Ah, here. We need to tell it to keep a stock uh, to step to full stacks. Yes, I know. I stole it. Oh well. What can I do? I am a, a Batman. I am a Batman. Let's give it a small surplus to get started for now. And of course, we're going to need one. And one piece of sand, which we don't have on us right now, but we can get uh, for uh, quickly now. Ta-da! See, they will fall if they if there's nothing behind. And I am going to need humus. I am going to need a sapling, and I am going to need some sticky resin because I need to set up things so. The system goes the way it should. And again, I can't find the electric tree tap. Here it is. Perfect. And the next thing I need is, of course, one piece of wood. Like this. Perfect. So, uh, let's graph ourselves some regular pipes, <coughs> stone transport pipes, and let's see, one goes out, see, oh yes, of course, we need an insertion pipe. Insertion pipe, a regular pipe and a piece of redstone. Perfect, we have all the materials at hand already. Okay, the insertion pipe goes in here. And we need to place the logger in there and the tree tap in here. Perfect. Now uh, this goes in here, this goes in here, and this goes in here. Mm, this goes here, diamond pipe. Basic logistics pipe. Nope. And teleporting pipe of uh, to a hundred. Can receive through. 
and we say range black can only pass humus and uh, blue can pass this can pass this can pass this and uh, yes can pass sticky resin okay here and nope here and we have uh, two problems right now I don't ha yes I do have crystal I do have stone so we can say hey hey yeah yeah perfect okay there we go perfect in here perfect in here perfect in here now we only need to place the item teleporting pipe in here and say frequency 100 can receive true yes of course we need to take into consideration the fact that it's night time and during night time uh, well solar power operations tend to um, stop <laughs> and you go in here you 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 and you and you perfect so that's it for now and, and there's a group of skeletons in there trying to steal the spotlight of course uh, but there were only two of them well three one succumbed to to the solar light so you can see the sticky resin won't get inside here and it will get launched to the frequency 100 and in theory if we go quickly hopefully quickly enough hopefully maybe maybe not not really fast enough no we should see the sticky resin coming into here from somewhere or not really as you can see it's in the miscellaneous junk uh, chest so I think I am going to do something uh, to solve that issue here I'm going to grab some gold which fortunately I have enough and I am going to grab one of the um, basic logistic pipes and you guessed it right I am going to craft a mark 3 pipe yes the logistic chassis mark 3 is an evolution of the mark 2 that has been so widely accepted on the front lines of Minecraft yeah it's now incorporating three module slots for your own amusement and improvement uh, of different module deployment so what modules are we going to place in here well essentially two of them are are, are already placed there we are going to place another pro uh, no another quick sort module so we need uh, diamond gear for lapis etc regular the usual stuff one of these uh, four of these three of these and one of these and yes I know this is a little overkill and it will be better if I left this chest here as the, as the default route However, I don't feel comfortable with uh, the incoming test being used as the default route. So I am going to replace this in here with this. And now I am going to say item sync module, default route in here, uh, the provider module. And this one won't, uh, will have to, like normal instead of leaving one, uh, one item per stack and a quick sort module. So now, in theory, we should get uh, the sticky resin being pulled out. I don't know where the hell the books were sent to.
I really don't. So I'll look uh, for them. Hopefully they won't be in here. No, they are not. Okay, they are here. Seems like there was uh, one book in here already. Uh, anyway, perfect. Now, in theory, the sticky resin should be taken off to here. This item sink has the sticky resin marked. Of course, the rubber wood is being processed first. Anyway, this is an um, expensive uh, solution to the problem and to my personal preference of not uh, using this as a default route. So, essentially, now we do have a steady supply of resin and I hope this is... Yeah, this is rubber wood. So, we have more than enough to craft uh, anything we need. And you can see lots and lots of... Uh, strange. Lots and lots of, uh, lots of sand will get in there. Oh, we have a small problem in here. Seems like the loggers are overlapping a little in here. Not a problem now that I place this. <clears throat> yeah, that's a uh, that's the problem of having this a little. Yes, see. Now we are trying to place saplings, regular saplings. Okay, and now I need a piece of uh, regular wood, I suppose. This should suffice. So yes, be careful because uh, loggers tend to overlap themselves if you place them close enough and you're going to need some sort of uh, well, solution. Now it should be okay, however. Mm, and I don't know why don't... Oh, of course. Of course. I completely forgot of this site. You, could you believe me? <laughs> I don't. Okay, stone transport pipe. Can't... Yes, yes, it can go like so. Perfect. Now this should go like a charm. And if we can, if we want to send items to the main system, we can place them in here, and they will be sent. You can place anything in the sand slot, so it's uh, quite a trick to send items to quick sorting without any uh, having to lay down any kind of system or going back to home. Let's see how the diamond production is here. <coughs> well, not bad, thirteen. 30, sorry, another 30, another 30, well, there won't be much difference, they will all produce more or less the same. And you can see, uh, with just a clock and uh, six filters and the like, well, this is exceedingly cheap considering the result it's producing. <clears throat> and the only thing that is really expensive here are the 12 condensers which uh, each one requires, let me think, like uh, five di 13 diamonds total, no, uh, 60 diamonds total, because there are 12 of them, 6 diamonds per unit. So 72 diamonds, no, 5 diamonds per unit, sorry, 5 diamonds per, per unit, so 30. And, uh, of course, they need a piece of one diamond to craft the dust we require, and other materials, like some iron, some smooth stone, etc. Anyway, I really like this system here, and, well, I might be thinking about updating my minecart uh, farm uh, there in a, in, a prox uh, in a following Let's Play to... Um, some craft powered one. Maybe I was really 
imagining things when I thought uh, the animals were reproducing by themselves. Oh well, not really a problem. We have a lot of bees in here, for what can I say. A lot of stained too. Let's start the cleaning process. And let's go sleep. And I believe this is a good wrapping up point. We saw how to set up another farm in here. We saw how to craft more stuff and make things completely automatic. And by the way, you have uh, more than than just these farms in farmcraft. Uh, sorry, farmcraft. Yes, forestry. You can have. Uh, <coughs> You can have a rubber tree farm, a wood farm, and you can have both wheat, sugarcane, and well, mushroom farm. You can even have um, a wart uh, working farm in here. Yes. Nether wart and nether wart. Yeah, this uh, this in here, in the overworld. How can you do that? Well, you require to use uh, a variant of bees that uh, only can be bred in the nether world. The fiendish uh, variant of bees. Anyway, for now I am really really uh, behind in the beekeeping part of the game. And, uh, well, <laughs> unsurprisingly, in the Feed the Beast uh, Let's Play series of Dire World 20, the, um, <clears throat> the thing that took them most time to get were the achievements for the bees. Essentially, well, they are random and it was like a 6% chance. They finished everything but the bees. <clears throat> and, uh, well, it was a little funny to see it. Considering you can start uh, breeding bees almost from the beginning on that map, I believe. Anyway, thanks for watching this episode and I'll see you in the next one. Have fun, people, and goodbye.